Hello and a warm welcome. This is the scene here at the Orange Vélodrome. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's France versus the Netherlands. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And this confrontation is underway. Here's the side France will go with. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Dayo Upamecano plays alongside Rafael Varane in central defence. Antoine Griezmann starts alongside Adrien Rabiot in central midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Olivier Giroud. He must finish! An alert reaction to tip it over. And the corner's been given. And taken short. No high quality defending. Here's the starting 11 for the Netherlands. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Nathan Ake in central defence. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Well, he has the measure of his opponent. Could be! Quite simply, an opportunity wasted. Easy for the keeper. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. A long way out. Well, the shot seemed like a good option, but goalkeeper's ball. Griezmann. An exciting talent who has everything a forward needs to be successful. Stuart, what are you expecting to see from Mbappe? I would describe him as majestic when he's playing at his best. Oh, Stuart, an opportunity. Closing down well, and still danger here. But offside is the decision here. The flag is up. Frankie de Jong. Oh, a lovely ball. The end product just wasn't there. Tempele. Now Griezmann. Good effort here. Well, the shot looked promising, but the keeper had the measure of it. This attack looks highly promising. De Jong. Very quick thinking there. Rabiot. Great vision from Adrian Rabiot. And they could do damage. And there it is. 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And Mbappe just hits it with such confidence. He strikes it so cleanly. It's a great goal. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Steven Bergwijn and with that the attack fizzles out well as you can see France have had much less of the ball but what they've done with it has been really good and they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment they love to play on the counter-attack more defending for them to do here though well he's missed the chance and the keeper didn't have to do very much Olivier Giroud Chouameni Giroud Rabiot excellent assessment of the situation at the back and the counter looks on here options available
Memphis Depay! Oh, that was begging to be put home, but the goalkeeper has it. Aurelien Chouameni. Good visualisation and execution. And strike touched onto the woodwork. Depay. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. And no more time left. We've reached the halfway mark here at the Orange Vélodrome. Well, the verdict's on Kylian Mbappe. In a word, positive. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general... And the ball is moving again, with France looking to build on a largely positive first-half performance here. And room now out on the flank. Mbappe. Now Griezmann. Griezmann! Absolutely spot-on with that challenge. Steven Bergwijn losing possession a bit easily Griezmann Mbappe Griezmann can he put it away and collected tidily he had plenty to think about Unable to keep the ball that time. Jihou. A very timely interception. Thirty minutes to go then. He'll have a go here. It looked as though it had a chance of going in for the equaliser. It was close, it was a decent effort, just need to keep plugging away now, and surely the goal will come. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Turam. Here's Mbappe. France moving the ball forward, what can they do from here? And it might be! Oh dear, not really troubling the goalkeeper at all, Stuart. Well, from that range he should be scoring, and he knows it. Turam, and back with Dembele, defended well. And this might not be the ideal situation for them. Substitution then, let's see how it affects the match. Intercepting it intelligently. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Tactically quite clear what they're doing, trying to get right on top of their opponents. It should be! Well, good defending, clattered out of there. Cup Mainers. And Depay on the ball. Not the best challenge, free kick. Well, just a warning from the referee this time. And I think the referee has got that absolutely right. It's not a card for me. And a no-nonsense. Plenty of support here. Well, they get themselves level here. Surely... Well, such a high degree of difficulty, not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. Rabiot. Mbappe. Nicely timed tackle. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. 
Well, they're attacking, but time is the great enemy. And the keeper able to hold on to it. Chouameni. Now with Turam. Rabio. Loves to attack from the wide areas. Can he finish them off? Timely intervention. Mbappe. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. De Jong. He's beaten his man. Oh, it's gone in! And that will be written down as an own goal. No wonder he's hanging his head. Well, as the replay shows us, that will be classed as an own goal. He's a bit unlucky there. There we have it. The 90 minutes are over and nothing to choose between the sides.